13 Action News Update sponsored by Silver State Schools Credit Union. I'm Kalina Srinos and right now in your 13 Action News Update, seniors living at a local housing complex woke up to flames and the sounds of sirens. Now the fire happened on Eastern between Washington and Bonanza. Several people living on the opposite side of the building have returned to their home. Estimated damages are in the range of $150,000. Happening today, thousands of culinary union members are set to rally on the strip. Now, the union says 35% or about 21,000 workers are still not back to work. They were laid off when the pandemic began. Now, this is the second rally in recent months. Another sign of Nevada's recovery. The state added more than 84,000 jobs since September of last year. That's the second most of any state. According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, Nevada's employment increased more than 6%. That's higher than California, Oregon, Idaho, Utah, and Arizona. There's some picture perfect weather out there for the next several afternoons. Our Thursday, sunny with highs in the upper 70s to near 80 degrees. Uh, we will dip down into the low 70s a couple hours after sunset by 8 p.m. Midnight, a chilly 66. Lows late tonight all the way back down to the 50s. Looking ahead to Sunday for trick or treat weather in the evening. Temperatures in the mid to low 70s, probably dipping to the 60s around 9 p.m. But all in all, the weather through Halloween weekend looks pretty fantastic. We flip the calendar to November on Monday and things still look pretty sharp with highs in the mid 70s next week. All right, Justin, thank you. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktmv.com and our free mobile app.